Now at 6, a missing man mystery. His family says CHP officers said they'd take him home, but he never made it. He was in a car with his brother who had just gotten pulled over for suspicion of drunk driving. Well, now more than two weeks later, his family is desperate to find the man who they, who they say suffers from dementia. CBS 2's Amy Johnson is live in downtown L.A. where they made a plea for help. Amy. That's right, Pat and Jeff. The family and their attorney held a news conference in front of the federal courthouse here today saying that this is where they would take the case if they had to because they believe those CHP officers made a huge mistake. Please, sir, please take my brother home. 62-year-old Donald James says he was pleading with the CHP officer that was taking him into custody for alleged DUI back on November 5th to take his twin brother, Douglas, who suffers from dementia, home. They told me they were going to take him home. They said, well, I'm going to take you home, too. I said, oh, man, go on. But they said, take me home. And I was very surprised and my brother wasn't there. The CHP says Douglas was dropped off along with his dog near Carl's Jr. in Arco next to the 110 freeway at Sepulveda around 10 that night. So to just drop him off anywhere, it's like I'm outraged at that. It's like, it's no respect. Dante James is Douglas's son. I don't know if he's, if he's eating, you know, he's not clothes properly for the weather you know it's gotten cold and it's been raining so it's like I'm, I'm just worried about his health. The family says Douglas was a boxer and began showing signs of dementia years ago. They say they are outraged the CHP dropped him off instead of calling a family member to pick him up. This is an outrage by the CHP. This shows total disrespect for a minority impoverished and, and disenfranchised uh, population. The CHP released a statement that says in part, it is our understanding Douglas James communicated with the officers freely and logically and exhibited no indication he was unable to care for himself. However, in light of these recent statements, we are reviewing the actions of the officers involved in this incident. I'd like to have my brother home for Thanksgiving, y'all. Please give us some help. Now, the family's dog was found five days later by a woman in Wilmington, and now the family hopes that someone will help them find Douglas. They say that he needs to be taking medication for his dementia. If you have any idea where he is, you're urged to contact the Los Angeles Police Department. Reporting live downtown LA, Amy Johnson, CBS 2 News.